So Marcus Houston's wife just gave birth to their son and this has put them in the limelight yet again. And people are talking about how messed up their marriage is in the first place. In case you didn't know, Marcus Houston's wife, Maya, was a teenager and he was almost 40 when they got married. And how she was kidnapped as a child and was declared missing for three years until she popped back up with Marcus. The streets are now alleging that Marcus and brainwashed Maya as a child and allegedly hid her from the cops. Y'all, there's a lot going on here, so let's break down this messy story. Marcus Houston and his wife Maya just welcomed their second child together, and while this should be a happy moment, people feel a type of way about this, and it opened up new conversations about Maya and how she was allegedly and brainwashed by Marcus and how they started dating when she was a minor. So back in 2020, Marcus and Maya got married, and this sparked a conversation about their concerning age difference. At the time, Marcus was 39 while Maya was only 19. And let's be real, it was weird. What made it even more sus is the fact that they got engaged only a couple of days after she turned 18. And that led people to suspect that they had actually been romantically involved way before Maya turned legal. Like why on earth was a 38 year old man hanging out with a minor to start with? They tried to claim that they only started dating after she turned legal these two really expected us to believe that they just met, started dating, and got engaged all in a couple of weeks? We weren't born last night, and we know how this happens. Let's be real here, guys. But it gets even shadier because we found out that Maya was a runaway child who had disappeared when she was only 15, and she was reported missing. She was reported missing until she turned up on her 18th birthday when she was engaged to Marcus. A Twitter user pointed out this disturbing detail and said, so Marcus Houston married a 19 year old who was reported missing since she was 15 and she just popped back up dating him once she was legal age. These men really be getting away with crimes right in broad daylight. We all knew about the creepy age gap, but the fact that Maya was a missing child is just some next level messed up stuff. According to sources, Mayana Dickey was reported missing by her adoptive parents in August 2016, age 15. It was believed she traveled to her birth mother who had lost custody back in 2012. Well, Maya stayed under the radar between 2016 to 2018 and nobody saw or heard anything from her. The interesting thing here is that during the years that she was listed as a missing minor, she was also listed as an art director on several Chris Stokes movies within that time frame. This was weird, cause what on earth did a runaway minor know about that? Once people started talking about this, the page mysteriously got scrubbed out of the internet. And if you're wondering what this has to do with Marcus, Chris Stokes was Marcus's manager. And this brings us full circle. According to the story that they told, Maya was besties with Chris Stokes' daughter, Chrissy. And they were such good friends that she was kind of like a bonus daughter to him. But this still doesn't explain why Chris and his family were with a minor who was legally missing and they didn't report. Yeah, that doesn't add up. And this is why people believe that Chris and his family had helped Marcus hide Maya from the public until she turned 18. And let's not forget that Chris Stokes himself has all those sick allegations against him by B2K member Raz B, who used to be managed by Chris. So this situation is just messy all around. Then we have this weird countdown that Marcus had on his Instagram in late 2018. And looking back now, people believe that he was counting down the days until Maya turned 18 and they could go public with their relationship. The countdown ended on October 7th, which just so happened to be Maya's 18th birthday. Anyways, Marcus tried to defend himself saying, I met Maya in 2018 through a mutual friend. Never before then did I even know she existed. The fact that she was listed on one of our films was a misprint or someone being messy. Maya is like a daughter to Chris Stokes because we are all like family. Being a Jehovah's Witness, we all showcase true love like family. That's it. Chris's real daughter, Chrissy Morales, became friends with Maya in 2018, where we all first met Maya at a Jehovah's Witness convention. It was then that Chrissy and Maya became friends. Maya and I didn't start dating until she was an adult. We fell in love and got engaged in March of 2019. This sounded like the typical explanation you get from grown men who know they are in the wrong. They make excuses and talk about how they were only friends when she was a minor and things only got romantic when she turned 18. We've seen and heard it way too many times. He also made this video where he tried to defend himself. Me and my wife's situation is a little different, you know, how we were, how we met, you know, through mutual friends and everything like that. You know, I, when I met my wife, she was 17. So, you know, we had no really conversation and no really connection until you know, she was of age and, you know, when we did finally start to talk, I was like, 
this woman is like me. And she was just like, when I would talk to her, she just, for one, we had a spiritual connection. And I feel like that's the most important thing. Being able to start being around her and talking to her and talking to like, we got it, we, we, we connected through music and you know, uh, her spirit, her kindness, her heart reminds me a lot of my mom and just. And now that Maya has had his second child, fans are now calling him out for allegedly Maya saying, I'm late, but I caught up on Marcus Houston stuff with this little girl. He's trash. That girl and then said, we both love Jesus, a creep and a criminal. Marcus Houston is coming off creepy. Simple. You was messing with a kid, my guy. P's always speaking about who's legal and who's not. Ain't no darn difference between you being 40 with a 17 year old and being 40 with an 18 year old. That's the same child, just a different day. This is really sad AF. How he really groomed this girl and really made her a wife and mother at 19 and surviving Marcus Houston documentary loading. This is kind of creepy, but y'all let me know what y'all thoughts are on this drama. Then check out this next video.